Brother. Brother, can I speak to you? Hello? Hello, brother. Oh. Sorry to wake you. Yes. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Hello. Yeah, are you? Do you work here? Yes. I work these houses. This is a bad night. So you know everyone? Everyone. Oh, okay. This one is my boss. The other one is that one. Another one, my boss. Okay, I, I, I'm, I'm looking for a job. So, I, I, I think maybe you can help me. No problem. Okay. No problem. You want a job? Yes, I'm looking for a nanny or a housekeeper. Job a fine. Cleaner. Job fine here. Thank you so much. Job fine here. So, uh, how can I meet your boss? First, first, before you meet my boss, mm. talk. Yeah, we are talking. I have to talk. Nothing for free. I help you. You help me. Oh, what are you trying to say? You are old enough. What are you trying to say? You are old enough. I help you. I can talk to my boss. That one, he can give you a job. That one, he can give you a job. But you help me. How? <laughs> you know. Oh, thank you. No, sorry. Sorry. Give me your number. No, thank Give you. Me your number. I'm sorry, I cannot do that. When all seems failing, do not give up. Trust in God, believe in Him, and keep on pushing. Look down on yourself, regardless of where you are coming from. to come to the address 27 Lone Street in Clifton. Yes, any time before 5 o'clock. It's with regards to the job. Yes, please. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you, bye. Let's have a 
have a seat. No, oh no, come on, no. No, mom, I'm fine. No, no, Ruth, please come. Sit I'm, on the couch. I'm fine, you see my clothes are dirty. No, please, do not insult me, come. You are a guest in my house. Come, come stand up. Oh, come on, come thank have a seat. You. Here, you have a seat over here. Okay, ma'am, thank you. So, Ruth, I got your message in the mail and I really want to help you. Please, tell me a little bit more about yourself. Um, my name is Ruthie. I do come from Malawi. I came here to look for a job so that I could finish my education. Yes. I could not finish my education because all my parents passed away and I was the first, and I'm the first born in our family. So, it was really hard for me to take care of my siblings and myself. So I came here to look for the job so that I, I can help my siblings and myself. But things are getting worse each and every day. I've tried so many things. I've tried to do business, but people try to take advantage of me. They want to sleep with me before they give me the job. Living in a street as a vendor, it's not a choice, but it's the situation I'm in. Struggling under the hot sun, trying to survive, I've nowhere to get food or press to live. I have no one to help me. Being mocked by ruthless people in the street every day, looking like a mad person in their sight. All this because I'm trying to earn honest living. I wish also to have a better life like others, but things are hard. Unfortunately, whatever I've tried, it's not working. That's why I end up here in the street, doing small, small things trying to survive. Uh, how are you? I'm good, thanks. How are you? But how much is the strawberry? It's two for 50 rents. I can buy everything. Wow, thank you. Do you have a plastic? Oh. But before I do that, you can help me. Okay, I can. You come with me. Come with you? I can change your life. Where? How? To my house. I can change your life. Do you want to buy the fruit or not? I want to buy it, but in one condition. I will give this to the people. I don't need it, but I want to buy it from you because I want to help you. So, you come with me, I buy everything. I think I, you're talking nonsense. I have the money, I can change your life. You're talking nonsense. I can change your life. You want me to change your life? I don't care about everything. I think you can go. Are you, you sure? Can, you're talking nonsense. Listen. You're trying to take advantage. Okay, stay with me. It's all my you life. It's fine. Right? I don't need to help. Ruth, that's horrible. I, I cannot believe that people would do this to you. It's worse and worse each and every day. I have friends where I've been going to beg for food and some money. But now they say that I must stop going to their place to beg for some money. I must join them into prostitution. Who's there now? I don't know. Let me, let me just go check. Who's there? Your usual customer, your client, she's here. You again? What do you want? What do you want now? I will explain. What? I want you to go this For what? For my rent or something. You? Uh -uh. I'm done with you. Martha, deal with her. Maybe you can help her. Ruthie, you can't be coming to us and borrow money all the time. Look at you, you're a good girl. You are beautiful. You have a nice body. Why can't you just be like us? You see us, we don't borrow money from anyone. We use our bodies to get money. Can't you also do the same thing? Huh? Do you like, do you like being poor like this? See how you are dressed up. Ruthie, a beautiful girl like you. I don't know why you're wasting your time. You have a nice body. No guy would reject you. Do you know how much money you can make with your body? Do you know? You can make 10,000 just in one week just because of your nice body. 
But I don't know why you're behaving like this. See how you are dressed up like a... You're I'm sorry to be bothering you every time, but you are all I have here. There's no way where I can go to pick money. But please understand me. Help me. All my things are outside right now. I have nowhere to sleep. I have no food. Please, if you can borrow me only 500 rand to pay my rent, I'll pay you back. I'm trying my best. I'm trying. Please, please help me. Luti, I heard what you said, but why can't you just join us? What is hard there to do when you have a nice body like that, huh? Luti, just join us and have a good life. But for me now things are hard, I can't borrow you money. Just join us, hey? I'm sorry my sisters that I come here every time to beg for some money, but things are really hard for me. I'm trying my best so that things can be okay. But I cannot sell my body. I really cannot sell my body for for money. What did you say, Rudy? You cannot use your body to make money. But you want us to use our body to make money so that we can be feeding you. No. Do you know those men the way they use it the whole night she to get the money? She doesn't know. And it, you it, are coming now. You are asking the money. We ask you nicely, join us. You said you can't do that. You don't want Look, eh? leave. Please get out. Leave our house. Go. Don't ever. We don't want to see you again. Come here by our door. Please. You don't want to join us, eh? But you want to eat our money for free. Go. Do you know how we? So please get out. Please. Get, no, get out, no, please. please. And enough. Listen here. Listen here. Get out. If you want us to help, go. The only way we will accept you is by you joining us. If not, don't ever come and show If you are not made, made up your mind, my dear. Go, loot no, 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 please. Ah, ah, ah. No, 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 your property is I had enough. Answer. I had enough. No, please, no, no, no. leave our house. No, leave no, our house. No, 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 no. Please, no, no. Martha, please, just no, no, no. push her out. Please, please, we got things to do, we got clients to attend. Please, ah, ah, ah. no, 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 Go, go, please, we don't have time for you. Go! If you want to come and join us, please go, don't come and Please, no! Only if you are greedy, join us. <laughs> Unfortunately, I cannot help you right now, but no, no, please, wait, wait. There is something I can do better for you than a job. You can see I'm a very successful woman and I went to business school. Now, my very good friend, he's the boss at the business school and they have scholarships available. I don't want you to be a domestic worker. I want you to be a strong businesswoman, be independent and make your own money. I'm going to call him now and I will see if they have that scholarship open for you. Would you appreciate that? Yes, I'll be very careful. Okay, let me get my phone. Okay. It's going to be okay. Okay. Hi, Peter. Yes. Yes, it's Linda. How are you? Yes. You remember how I was one of your top students at the business school? Now I have a big favor to ask you. I have a beautiful young woman here by my house. A very smart, intelligent woman. And I want to know, is that scholarship still available for the business school? Yes. Yes, she is a foreigner from Malawi. Well, if you have that position available, I would love to put her forward to fill that position. Fantastic. I will send you all of her details. Thank you very much. Now Ruth, I can't make any promises, but he's a very good friend of mine. Mm -hmm. And I know that if you get this scholarship, you will be more wealthier than you can imagine. And I ask only that you will stay pure and that you will stay humble as you have been. Yes, and you never give up on yourself. 
yes. and that you work hard for this. And yes. one day you will prove all these people wrong. Yes, we will help you. Thank you. Whatever God has prepared for you will come to pass. No one can take it away from you. It may be delayed, yes, but it will come to pass. You are the only obstacle to your blessing if you don't believe in yourself. The green light is on the way.